So broke the track record for seven eighths of a mile. Yeah, great actually. Well, the track looks seems pretty pretty fast, you know, right now. But uh, no, he also running a great race. He's also a, a stakes winner in you know, a Delta Down uh, earlier this year. So very pleased with uh, with the effort. But very sharply today, put me in a great spot and uh, was very uh, tenacious, you know, all the way down the lane and show a lot of uh, grit and uh, courage. And, and the only other time he rode him was his last race and. He, he didn't have, uh, didn't run so well that day. What happened at the start? Yeah, the like last time he he, uh, he broke a step through and make an awkward step, you know, like maybe second or third jump. Not sure you know what happened, stumble or kind of like something happened. And uh, I thought, you know, he made a fast step and hurt, hurt himself for a little bit. But uh, no, he came back and nothing happened. So uh, that was just a throwout race. And uh, he shows today, you know, uh, came back in form and uh, I'm glad he did. You're off to a good start this meet. Brad Cox is off to a really good start this meet too. Just want to talk about the start of your meet here at Ellis Park. Well, a great start. Like you said, when you ride, you know, for a top trainer in the country, it's always easier, you know, to, to add wins, you know. Uh, we have, I believe, you know, the best quality of horses uh, right now, you know, in Kentucky. So him and Steve Asmussen, so a uh, big step forward when you ride for, uh, for Brad, you know, it's a big help. Uh, very thankful uh, for, the opportunity, for the opportunity he has given me and also, uh, his honors, so hopefully we can just uh, keep on adding wins and uh, have a lot of trips uh, lined up out of town uh, pretty much every weekend, so be a lot of uh, lot of travel for me, but uh, happy to come back here all the time. It's a track I like and uh, I think it's a great track for horses and uh, of course it's very fair and uh, very uh, excited about the, what's coming up for this summer. Yeah, no, it's great for you because you'll be, like you said, you're going to be gone a lot of weekends including the ride Mandaloon and the, um, the Haskell. Yeah, exactly. Like Tomorrow I'm riding Bunny South in the uh, Delaware on the cap next following week. Uh, like you said, Mandaloon. I was on trips to California, also Delma and Saratoga lined up. So, no, exciting. And uh, we have a lot of babies too. That's the reason why I'm, I'm staying here. And uh, I believe Brad has over 100 three all here in Kentucky. So, give me at least a uh, good access, you know, to walk them in the morning, knowing in them, you know, if, if they're, even if they are not running here, uh, they're still going to run at Churchill in September. So, at least uh, it's nice, you know, to. Uh, to have a great feel for those horses.